All right, when it comes to the president of the United States, Barack Obama, we all got our own opinions of him. And some of them are really good, some of them are really bad. It depends on who you are, I suppose. And you know, even though you may find this astonishing, not all black people love everything that he does all the time of the day. But I mean, I personally favor him myself. There are a few things that are questionable, in my opinion, about his campaign and his regimen over the last three years. But I mean, still, I feel like he is at least very, very informed when it comes to pop culture, social media, and whatnot, and his presence as to where he stands with the world. And I feel like that's a very admirable quality of him. I mean, he's a president who feels like he's involved with the country, you know? I mean, sure, decisions here and there sometimes don't go with everybody, but I, at least it feels like he's paying attention. It's on He's on the life pulse of what's actually going down. And I, lo I love that about him. So I mean, hey, whatever the case may be, this isn't a video necessary to worship him, but to address something that he did recently. Now, I didn't get a chance to look at this myself, but Kurogal did. And once again, I want to thank you for sending me these articles, guys. These will be in the description below. But she sent me an article talking about Obama thanking Japan's prime minister, whose name is Abe apparently, for karaoke, manga, anime, and emoji. So, <laughs> wait a minute. Obama, Obama, Obama. I love this nigga. <laughs> Yo, man, I gotta see this shit for myself. I wanted to, uh, for some reason, Total Biscuit was linked in this as well, too. I don't think he responded to this. Total Biscuit is a fucking god. But I mean, still, let's take a look at exactly what Obama said to the Prime Minister of Japan. Um, can, can you got like, Japan still has an emperor, if I'm... If I'm if I'm correct, Japan still has like an emperor system and whatnot, but the prime minister is also a high-ranking official, of course, as most of you would know. So let's take a look at exactly what Obama said to this dude, because I mean, it's one minute and 18 seconds long. I didn't get to see this shit myself. So, I mean, come on, Obama. <laughs> let's go. What did this dude say? What did this dude say? On behalf of the American people, mm -hmm. and Michelle and myself, it is a great honor for me to welcome Prime Minister Abe, and Mrs. Abe, I call this Japan, nigga Abe. one of America's <laughs> His closest name's allies Abe. in the world. Today's also a chance for Americans, especially our young people, to say thank you for all the things we love yes. from Japan. <laughs> like karate and karaoke. <laughs> karaoke? Manga. Manga? And anime. Anime? <laughs> and of course, emojis. Emoji? You my nigga. This visit also has historic significance. Oh, shit. <laughs> In 1960, President Eisenhower welcomed Prime Minister Abe's grandfather, Prime Minister Kishi, here to the White House. Nice. They signed the security treaty that endures to this day, committing America and Japan to an indestructible partnership. An indestructible partnership. <laughs> Damn, man. Thank you, Thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody. That was so badass. See, I don't know about you niggas, but I feel like Obama's speaking skills, like whenever he's on the podium, have improved drastically from when we first saw him years ago when he was first running for president. I feel like Obama's speaking skills are on point now, even though he's always had that presence. But I mean, now it seems like he stutters a lot less too. A lot of people used to make fun of him for that. So I guess he fixed it himself. But I mean, still, what an impressive speech right there. The way that he addressed the Japanese prime minister when he was talking about the things that young people love from Japan, at first it could be taken as somewhat offensive because I mean, I mean, you know, obviously, he's, what, 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 are you highlighting our meeting today just for the sake of anime, manga, emoji, and all that? I mean, at first it could be taken like that, but then he totally flips the script and makes things so respectful, bringing up the pact that Eisenhower made with Abe's great-grandfather years ago to bring the United States and Japan closer than they ever had been before. It's really admirable to see Obama be able to acknowledge the things that the mainstream society has with certain issues, but then to, you know, bring things back to that respectable state, you know what I mean? Obama, you get brownie points just for acknowledging the existence of these things and saying them in public to a fucking prime minister. Everyone was laughing though, it was hilarious, I mean. President Eisenhower That shit was fresh as hell. That shit was fresh as hell. From Japan. Like karate. Karate. And karaoke. <laughs> karaoke. Manga. Yep. And anime. Anime. And of course, emojis. Yo, <laughs> wait a minute, do you see how this dude this dude Abe was looking at Obama. He was looking at him like. And karaoke. Dude, look at his fucking face. Manga. And anime. He was laughing. I mean, he was taking of it course, as a joke, but I mean, he was emojis. looking at him like. <laughs> Yo. This visit also has historic significance. Yo, did I see one emojis. of the soldiers in the back laugh? Like karate. And karaoke. I see, I see a soldier laugh. I think I saw a soldier. Manga. Laugh. Yo, look at this. Look at this dude in the back. Look at this. Look at this uh, official-looking dude in the back laughing. And anime. 
Yo. And of course, emojis. <laughs> Yo. And this visit also has Bruh. historic significance. The, yeah. Um, I thought this would be a little fun video to highlight. I didn't get to see this myself beforehand. So, I mean, what do you guys think of this whole thing? Once again, another thing that just makes it so Obama is really lovable in a lot of ways. It's really cool seeing that he acknowledges the things that us young people like. And who knows, maybe Obama is a fan of a couple of anime himself. You know, I wouldn't put it past him. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.